So of course today is a show day and I am taking you all along for the ride. As always, very excited to get on with this one. Soon I'm going to make my way down to the train station, make my way down to the venue to rest on the show. It's going to be a lot of fun. Today I'm making my CPW debut, which is super exciting. I know a few people are quite excited to have me there, so I think it's going to be a great show. And if you're new here, this channel is all about me and my pro wrestling journey. Am I nervous for today? You know, weirdly, not so much. I think in every single one of these show vlogs that I've done, I've always said like how nervous I am. You know, I was nervous for my first match, second one, third one, and this one. I think it's because in my last one, which was that triple threat match that I had, somewhere during that match, I like found my confidence. I think I even said during the video that I watched the footage back and I was like, you're, you're a good girl. You, you know what you're doing. You're gonna do well. It's nice having this, um, confidence begin to grow <laughs> finally and yeah I just don't feel as nervous like I'm sure there's still like a few nerves there I'm sure like I'll be a little bit nervous right before I go through the curtain but it's not it doesn't feel nearly as much as what it's been for the three matches that I've had uh, previously to today but anyway without any further ado let's get on with it hello my beautiful features it's your demon queen the hellcat the british andre the devil secretary the duchess of the damned also known as succubus I'm about to make my way down to the train station so uh yeah let's do this thing glorious purpose baby guys so as you can see i've arrived at the show we've just had a bit of a a bit of a briefing for like the run of the what we're doing today which is pretty cool i always like it when shows do that and it kind of makes it feel more like a team but on that note nothing but wonderful vibes everyone's been very welcoming to me i think i've realized today <laughs> But I'm a very shy person because when we're having the little briefing, they mentioned my name. But I'm having my CPW debut and everyone clapped and I'm just like, ah. and so like in that moment it's like, I am a really shy person. I've had a few people say that I'm shy. Like I did the show at Firestar the week before and I was also told like, oh, you're like really shy um, over there as well. So uh, yeah, I think it's, uh, I think uh, tonight it's definitely clicked with me. I'm a, I'm a shy person when it comes to uh, actually meeting people in person. Online, I must seem like a huge dork, uh, which I am. But yeah, everything is looking wonderful. I'm excited to get on with this match. I think it's gonna be awesome. It's gonna be a great time for me and like the fans. Uh, which is really what it's all about, is just putting on a good show, something that people can come together and watch and enjoy. And uh, yeah, very, very excited. It's gonna be awesome. So anyway, I'm about to put on my wrestling gear, get my, get my game face on, activate my demon eyes, and uh, yeah, match number four is Succubus. Let's do this. <laughs> All right, guys, I've got my game face on. I'll be heading out there shortly, so, you know, wish me the best of luck. Uh, got a bit of a new outfit on tonight. Super excited. Everything's been so wonderful and lovely in here so far. And, uh, I think it'll be a great match and very excited. Very, very excited. Started to get a, a little bit of those nerves now. Still not quite as bad, which is good. I guess I will see you guys out there. Peace. Peace, peace, peace. Hey guys, so I've not long arrived home. Uh, this is usually the part of the video where I would show off a few highlights of the match, usually followed by me talking backstage about how the match went and just uh, my post-match thoughts, really. The reason I haven't done that for this vlog and I'm just gonna kind of just cut straight to it. My opponents got injured and uh, it was, you know, it was nobody's fault. And I can safely say that every single person at CPW handled the situation as best as what they possibly could. They did everything right. It was just one of those things where it's just kind of the nature of wrestling. Like sometimes injuries just happen. And as I, as I say, it's not anyone's fault. It was one of those moments though, where um, it took me a while to actually realize that she was injured. It wasn't until a certain point in the match after I believe a German suplex where I realized that she was hurt. And I kind of felt like even before that, like something wasn't quite right, but uh, injury never like came to my mind. So it was really, really unfortunate, but 
uh, everyone uh, at that wrestling company um, really took care of my opponent when she got back. You know, they were looking after her, making sure she was okay, not just uh, physically, but also like mentally, because when injuries like this happen in wrestling, it can really mess with your mind. And I myself also didn't really feel that great. I know I'm like not the one that got injured, but it kind of like messes with me as well. Quite a few people that were asking like how I was and I, I'd say that I was fine, but I, I think it was quite easy to tell that I wasn't. It kind of brings you back to reality that, you know, what we're doing is very dangerous and you can get seriously injured doing this stuff. And it was also very unfortunate because this was supposed to be my my big CPW debut. I was hoping to do all this stuff. And even though the injury happened and like we were taking care of that backstage, we were also trying to figure out a way where we could still do something with me. And there were talks about me having uh, another match with somebody else. And it's kind of like trying to figure out like what we can do. But I'll be honest. I really didn't feel like going out there and trying to wrestle in a, in a match. I really don't think I was in the right mental headspace to do it. Um, if I did, I feel like I, would just, I was just forcing myself and I really didn't want to. I just, it didn't feel right to me. But then I came up with the idea. I was like, okay, well, what if I just did a promo instead and this is actually what we ended up doing they actually allowed me to go out and and have this promo and i am going to show you uh clips uh, some highlights of that promo to close out this video but as you're watching this video of me cutting this promo i want you to understand two things one everything i said out there was completely true and real and I was just being myself and just being honest and it seemed like people really connected with that which you know was cool. I felt like that was the best way to go about stuff. The second thing that I want you to understand about this promo that you're about to watch is that the theme that I was trying to create with this promo is about having a moment about creating a moment so i really want you to keep that in mind when you watch this promo for now thank you so much for watching this video if you want to continue watching me on my pro wrestling journey then feel free to subscribe i'll catch you all next time enjoy the promo i had a match earlier against harley face and she had an unfortunate injury to her shoulder and i know there's a few people out of the crowd who came out because they wanted to see Sookie Bus wrestle in this ring tonight. I was really hoping that I could pull out just one more moment to have my moment in this ring for all of you here tonight. Whether you love Holly or you hate her, hate her, she is a fierce competitor and she did so incredibly well. recognize that, to recognize what an athlete she is, how incredible she is, and she really gave it her all tonight. You have such an incredible team here at CPW. <laughs> Thank you.